patients need to be able to communicate with their practitioner and the practitioner with the patient. And you have to have a common language for that. From the patient's perspective, what they're able to look at are what reference points am I measuring a treatment against? All right, so a treatment would need to work. So the patient is really clear about what it is that they want fixing or which symptom, the pain of which symptoms they want to see reduce. But they also have an idea of where they would like to end up in terms of treatment dependency. So, and this is a, a language that the medical practitioner speaks as well, because it's a risk mitigation language. So it's which risks do I need to mitigate? So when a patient is talking to a practitioner around choices of treatment, they'll be able to talk about which symptoms will this treatment help. And will by going on this treatment, where will I end up? Will I be able to come off it? Or what else do I need to do in order to be able to reduce my risks? It opens up the field then for other things that a patient may be thinking of doing, where they can bring their specialist or their doctor in the loop saying, I'm doing this as well as, as doing this treatment. Will you monitor me? And of course, the big thing is that if a patient has as one of their reference points where they don't want to end up, this fits so neatly with where the medical practitioner is focused because the reason we get medications or we're given drugs is to, it is to stop us to also slow the progress or the process of ending up with an acute event, say a heart attack or you know, in diabetes, limb amputation. So treatments are really done to, to, as a risk mitigation. So if a patient can also factor that in, and, and let the um, specialist know that they're on the same page, then the specialist or the doctor will know that that patient isn't driving blind. And I think that's the biggest problem is when the practitioner feels this patient's just read something on the internet, they're just focusing on the risks of the treatment. They're not looking at what it could do for them. And I don't want to work with this person but it changes the landscape completely. So it's just those key reference points, very simple, very, very simple.